Hi, this is Steve Holtz for CSP TV. The next door on our tour of Atlanta is really a lesson in knowing your neighborhoods. David Jaffer and his partners found a site that was condemned and ready for redevelopment. He turned it into the in-town market. It's a site you won't forget. Let's take a look. David, I appreciate you joining us today. Um, you've got a really unique spot here, and it's in an interesting neighborhood as well. How did you pick this site, and what are some of your goals? Uh, when we started, we looked at uh, several of the places around Atlanta, and when we came upon this site, just uh, driving through downtown, we realized that this place was just sort of uh, being gentrified. And at the first look, it was kind of disheartening to even think that we could even come and open. But as we studied the neighborhood, talked to some of the people here, uh, we realized this is the place we really wanted to be, although not now or when we started, but certainly a year down or two years down the road, we, we thought that this would grow real well. And that was our decision to uh, come into this place. Our goal over um, the next several years is to sort of take this little market and turn it into um, sort of like the European market. You know, it's amazing what they do in Europe with the little small space they have. And so when I spent a little bit of time there, I realized that our markets are just too big and we just have too much open space. So to be able to make it quaint um, and really get everything we want, maybe not 100 of the same item, but at least 10 of each and just really give um, um, a vast choice to the consumers that are here. We're really um, gearing up for walk-in traffic. That's how we sort of laid the store out in the 2700 booth to make it uh, friendly that way. Okay. Uh, you, you certainly stress beer and wine in this site. What made you go that route? We love to eat and drink, and so uh, it was sort of natural. And when we looked around uh, the neighborhood, the only thing that uh, we saw were a very large uh, package store, and uh, we really wanted a convenience store that emphasized more on wine and beer. This is not the typical model. But then again, you know, we're not typical operators. Right. So we decided to go with craft beer, and, and the response has been really great for yeah. the people that live in the area. Okay. So. What have you done with food service here? Uh, food service, we, we thought about bringing in a national franchise, but everything that we do, we wanted to keep it a local, uh, give it a little local flair, so we opened our uh, deli. And our emphasis is on quality, freshness, uh, of our meat and everything else that we use in the, in the deli and really get to know our customers and what they want. So, you know, we, we, we add items as we see the need for it, but the emphasis is, yes, it's, it's quick, it's fast, but it's also fresh and healthy. So that's why we added a deli. So if you're interested in seeing the in-town market for yourself, it's at 349 Decatur Street, which is just outside the Grant Park neighborhood. Reporting for CSP-TV, I'm Steve Holtz.